Hey everyone, uh, thank you for tuning back in. I um, I know we said that our next video was going to be focused on you know doing our budget. Yes. Um, did. but you know we were in the gym today working out, and this guy came up to us and well first he asked you know oh are we is this my sister? We look like siblings. <laughs> um, but then. He said, you know, stay together, have fun, you know, basically, you know, just stay together. Mm -hmm. And he made one comment that Lee didn't get to hear. And, you know, we said we are, that's the plan, we're doing all this. But he looked at me, he said, you know, it's your responsibility. And I think that's something I want to touch back on a little bit more further. Mm -hmm. um, not to discredit what we said or contradict it. I do believe in everything that we said regarding gender roles, but I do believe there's one key aspect to hone in on, and that is that as a man, it doesn't matter that, you know, you pay for all the bills. Mm -hmm. But I feel that it's important to know that everything that goes on under the roof of your house, your apartment, or whatever your situation is, is your, is your responsibility. And by that, I mean that not everything is your fault, mm -hmm. but the, the weight, the impact of those decisions should fall on your shoulders. And for us, what we- What do you mean by that? Guys, it's the first time we're doing this video, so we're going to have a real conversation. <laughs> um, <laughs> what I mean is that, for instance, for us, mm -hmm. we do our budget so that we can live off of one income. Mm -hmm. that, is not to, that is not to say that I relax or that I chill because we don't need that extra money for us to work, live under. Um, as a man, I do believe in working hard and sacrificing and doing what needs to be done for your family. And I think that's important, one, because even if you don't make the, the most money in the household, even if you don't da-da-da-da, if you're out there hustling and grinding, I feel that you're still providing somewhat of a sense. Mm -hmm. Because... Yes, yeah, so I'm just still providing. You're still providing. You may not have, you know, at the moment, you may not make the most money. But I don't care if you're working at Kroger and you have three side hustles, you have a little, you're hustling. And I think hustling is a, is a huge thing that you have to have in a relationship, especially from the man's point of view. Yeah, I don't think. Doing you, whatever you have to do to make sure your family is. Right. I don't know if you guys can hear that. <clears throat> doing whatever you have to do to make sure that your family is. I don't it means taking care of. Yeah, and so, care of that's right. one thing that I told Lee from the very beginning was, you know, we're going to live up on income to pay off debt. But for me, I always told Lee, you know, once we pay off debt, we have our savings. If you want to stop working and do whatever your heart, your heart calls you to do, and that could be anything. It could even be, it can even be something that produces an income. But it doesn't necessarily have to be her working an eight to five mm -hmm. in a traditional engineering job. And even then, you didn't even say uh, you didn't even say we had to pay off debt before I could not work. You gave me the option up front, right? But um, being that we both have student loans, like I don't think that that would be um, fair. Is not the word I'm looking for, but I don't think it would be right to just say, "Okay, you're gonna do everything." Right. No, that's not what it's supposed to be. And I think it takes a, a certain point in your relationship. Like, you have to know that person. Like, I know Lee's not going to take advantage of that. I know she's going to at least do something. Even if she just stopped working, I know she would do something on the side. Mm -hmm. a somewhat of a side hustle. Mm -hmm. But my, I just wanted to emphasize that, yes, there are no gender roles. You know, you cook, you da-da-da-da. But that doesn't mean become lazy or complacent. And that doesn't mean that I sit back and I don't lead or have any have a drive or a passion. I'm not over I'm not dominating, I'm not overseeing, mm -mm. but it's just I know that there's a responsibility that comes when you're in a relationship. And I want to stress that to any any other men out there who are, or who 
are thinking about it or who have different opinions on it, I would love to hear it. Um, but from my aspect, I see it as men, we have to do, we have to work, we have to, we carry, we carry, we're not the, the, the master of the ruler, but we carry the stick. When stuff goes down, it falls on your shoulders because you don't want to fall on hers, in my opinion. Mm-hmm. And then again, it's not like we have all the answers or we know everything. This is just what works for us and what, how we view things. Um, yeah. Yeah. So let me get back to uh, preparing everything for the video about the budget. It, it actually is coming next. So <laughs> sorry about that. But I just think that was something important for us to uh, discuss again. Now I'm going to eat my soup. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Bye. Bye. <laughs>